Good morning. June 3rd today, uh, 2 Chronicles 21 and 22, and then John 14. Um, today we're here in jo Johor Joharham, um, is um, um, basically falls into the same sin as um, Cain, and Cain did with Abel. Um, you know, jealousy of the brother and, and had him wiped out. And Elijah uh, uh, goes and warns him about uh, his behaviors and and how he's doing things. Um, you know, it's just, uh, um, you know, once again, a, um, a look at, at um, you know, how God is wanting us to live and, and, and do things. Um, but um, this morning I had probably more hope in my heart than in I, I've had in a while. Uh, shared yesterday a little bit, you know, about my feelings and, and um, you know, where I was at with things right now, kind of being discouraged and, and um, um you know, saddened with everything that's going on, but uh, you know, Scripture never fails me. Um, I, 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 I pray that's true for you too. Um, God's word says it, it'll never come back void. Um, so again, I, I believe, you know, our theme this year, the word of God grew and it multiplied, and and the more we're into it, the more we. Um, you know, we see, you know, destruction and we see violence and we see a lot of those things in the Old Testament. Um, and, and to be honest, we're seeing those things in our world today. Um, you know, that's human nature. You know, we're coming off of sin. We're coming off of uh, a broken, uh, has broken people um, needing Jesus Christ. And and I guess it never was open to my eyes more so than probably this morning um, and the hope that, that we have through Scripture. Uh, John 14, the very first part of the Scripture, uh, tells me there's, we have hope. It says, Do not let your hearts be troubled. Believe in God. Believe also in me. Um, you know, that's the bottom line of our faith. Um, and, and that's where it needs to be, you know. Do not let your hearts be troubled. Um, you know, know that we're only here for a short time. We're 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 not here uh, for eternity. We have a God who um, sent His Son to die for us, and and His promises that that He didn't leave us alone. You know, we heard Sunday He left the Holy Spirit with us, but it's not only that. You know, um, you know Ascension Sunday or Ascension Day. We we you know we we heard Jesus go. To be in heaven uh, with his father, to be at his right hand, and 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 he's not there doing nothing. Um, he says right here, "I go and prepare a place for you." Um, I've preached that message uh, a hundred times, if not more, you know, at funerals, um, and and I believe that. I believe that. I believe he's going and preparing a great place for us. And, um, you know, and why would we not think that he's going to come back for us? And, and, and again, even though our world is chaotic right now and, and, and in turmoil, um, you know, we don't need to rush things. We don't need to wonder if God's going to fulfill that promise. We know that. Um, by faith, we know Jesus is there preparing a place for us. And, and he brings us home when, when, when it's his time, not ours. Um, he's going to come back on his time, not ours. And and even though we think, you know, that that that, hell, uh, that uh, uh, you know the, the world is 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 going to kabooey, um, you know, God has a different plan. He's he's his plan is 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 ultimate, um, and it's it's wonderful. So, um, you know, the whole scripture in. In, in chapter 14, it's got Jesus just, um, you know, encouraging his disciples, reassuring them, uh, comforting them, knowing that, you know, where he's going and he's going to come back for us. Uh, he's not leaving us alone. And, and, and if nothing else jumps out at you today, just remember that. Don't let your hearts be troubled. Um, believe in God and believe also in Jesus. I mean, it's, it, it's, it's real simple theology again. 
you know um, we talked yesterday you know just you know love God and love people you know uh, first thing is to love God and, 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 and that's, that's what we're called to do. And, and by doing that, our hearts aren't going to be troubled. You know, we're not going to be troubled by these things. Um, so my prayer is that I'm, I'm removing myself from, from all this negativity, uh, being shut down from coronavirus, uh, you know, the, um, the riots that are going on. You know, God's got this. He'll take care of it. Um, you know, this, this possibly could be in his divine plan. Um, you know, it's, it's hard for us to see that, but, um, you know, um, you know, could this draw people closer to him? Possibly. We see that in scripture. You know, we see people finally the light going on and, and turning to God and, and, and even in all, all the destruction in the old Testament, uh, we see people uh, time after time after time again, um, getting in the Word, seeing the Word, and, and, and changing their lives, doing things different. Yes, it's on a roller coaster ride. And, and that's kind of how our, our society has been in our world. Um, I mean, if we look all the way back to, um, you know, the beginning of our country, uh, you know, it's been on a roller coaster ride as far as, 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 far as peace. Um, you know, this, this is still an experiment. Um, that we're in, you know, we're, we, we, uh, you know, as far as the freedom of the United States, <clears throat> and again, we're still a blessed nation. We're still the ones who, um, you know, um, are coming. I mean, our country is 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 that of being free. Um, there's so much worse out in this world, and 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 we don't see it. Um, so. I, I, I'm, I'm looking at things more um, with wide open eyes today, um, more so with my faith in anything. Um, so again, my prayer for you, my prayer for myself, I, my prayer for our nation is that, um, you know, uh, the believers just sit back and, and they, they, they don't let their hearts be troubled by this. Be an example, be a witness. Um, you know, uh, you know, we heard scripture on, on Sunday, you know, um, the disciples were, were pleading with people to turn their life to God. That's what we need to be doing. That's where we need to be at. So um, have a great day. Um, you know, read scripture again over and over. Um, and if nothing else, you know, write that down you know, somewhere and, and put that up. Do not let your hearts be troubled. Uh, believe in God and believe also in me. God bless you all. Have a great day and I will see you in the morning.